Hey guys, welcome back to the Jones Zone. Today I uh, wanted to share a dream with you that I had. And, uh, you know, there's, just, there's a lot of dreams that I have and I, I'm, I'm, I'm always under some kind of uh, spiritual attack. I have a lot of dreams. Uh, some of them, I guess, are, are nightmares, but uh, there's a lot of dreams and I think these are, these are obviously spiritual. And so, uh, I just, you know, I'll be honest with you, these are, these are kind of of a sexual nature, but they're not explicit or anything like that. But, um, I'd like to tell you about a dream that I had <laughs> where, um, there was a, um, I was in a, uh, like a, a sub place or something like that, maybe a subway or something. I was ordering a sandwich. And there's a, a young woman in there, blonde hair. She's ordering her sandwich. And, uh, you know, uh, something happens where uh, her sandwich, uh, I'm not sure, it, like, I get her sandwich. There's some kind of mix-up. I end up getting her sandwich. And then uh, they're like, uh, she's like, hey, you ate my sandwich, you know, because I, I start eating her sandwich. And then uh, I'm like, okay. I'm sorry about that. So when I go in my pocket. I pull out like twenty dollars because the sandwich is probably ten dollars. So I'm like, I'm gonna give her an extra ten dollars. She can keep the change for her trouble. And I do that. And um, you know, right when I um, give her the money, I remember giving her the money. And I remember taking another bite because I have the sandwich now. And she comes at me, and she jumps right on top of me. Like, we're in, we're in the open, right? Just in the open. Everybody can see us, okay? And she, boom, just jumps right on top of me. I fall on top of a, I'm not sure if it, the table, it may have been the ground or something like that. But I, I fall and she's mounted on top of me, guys, this woman. And um, she's uh, holding me down here and I'm, I'm struggling and I'm trying to, to, to get her off of me. And I'm, I'm trying to bench press her, you know what I mean? Like, I can't get her off, no matter what I'm doing. I'm, I'm trying. She's on my chest. I'm trying to breathe. I'm pushing with all that I have to try to, to, to push this woman off me. So I, I remember doing one shot, one push. I couldn't do it. I did a second push. She, she kind of goes up a little bit. And then finally, I'm like, okay, this is one of those dreams now where uh, you have the woman sitting on your chest, the succubus or whatever. Is. I realize what this is. And she's, she's, she's putting all of her... Her weight on me and I, I can't go nowhere I'm, I'm pretty much paralyzed guys that's what this is and finally I get this burst of energy that comes through me <laughs> and I'm like the power I have boom and then I shove her off me she flies up to the ceiling and then I wake up guys and when I wake up let me tell you <laughs> I felt I felt amazing I felt like that the strength that I had coursing through me was so powerful that it must have been God. It was not my strength to do that. Okay, to, to lift that the woman, to, to push her the way that I did, that demon, okay, that succubus in that dream. Because, you know, demons are powerful. They have a, a sense of, of when it comes to, like, putting their dreams on people and paralyzing them and stuff like that, you know, we're usually supposed to pray to the Lord. That's what we're supposed to do to handle that, to, to call upon the name of Jesus. I didn't have to do that. It just, I felt the, the in, in, in my, like just in my body, a whole bunch of power just, just coming through and just going and bubbling inside of me. The power I have. <laughs> and I got that demon off of me. That woman flew into the ceiling and like vanished, like bloop, and then I woke up. It was crazy. I mean, it was it was it was awesome, guys. Pay attention to your dreams because God really does work through your dreams. You know, a hundred percent, without a doubt, it was God in that dream that was doing that. You know, I hear stories all the time about people who were having the woman sit on them, the succubus to sit on them and stuff. They ain't going nowhere. They just sit there paralyzed, you know, for 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 many many minutes and all this kind of stuff. They feel drained when they wake up. All kinds of things like that. Me, no, I felt amazing. <laughs> I felt absolutely amazing when this happened. It was really cool. It was really cool. 
you know, um, I just remember just being really thankful that, you know, hey, this is God doing this, you know, doing this, doing this for me. You know, I got to the point where I was like, wow, this God is just really working through my life and helping me battle these, you know, these, these, these dreams, these sexual dreams and stuff like that. So, yeah, that's um, all I really have for you guys. Thanks for listening. Um, and uh, God loves you. And I love you.